Mr. Speaker, it's clear that the Prime Minister's foreign policy is a disaster and Canadians are paying for his mistakes. Our international partners have no respect for this Prime Minister. And why should they? After clowning around in India and inviting a convicted terrorist along with him, he then was forced to take concession after concession from Donald Trump. He even angered our partners in Japan and Australia. And now we have the debacle with China. Why do the Prime Minister show such weakness and wait so long? to fire his ambassador. The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, I look forward to answering the member's question shortly, but uh, I think before we do, we need to take a moment to recognize and applaud the extraordinary women and men who worked so hard uh, to build this beautiful chamber for us to serve in, and to remember that if we who serve Canadians in this place work even half as hard as they worked uh, to build this place for us, uh, we will be very well served as a country indeed.